he came here exclusively to sleep with women, then that's a waste of money on his part and a waste of the professor's time. A University of Portland tennis star has been kicked off the team after giving a speech that's been called anti-women and violent. This is Coin 6 News at 11 o'clock. I'm Jennifer Hoff. And I'm Jeff Gianola. That student was emceeing an athletic awards banquet when he launched into what was described as locker room talk. Our Jennifer Dowling live with much more on that fallout over that speech tonight. Jennifer? Good evening. As you can imagine, this is the talk of campus, and the student did issue a short apology and the university a statement about it, but many students here say it's not enough. And I think it just kind of like reinforces like rape culture. Sarah Craney says it's already tough for young women to feel safe on campus, and comments made by tennis player Gautam Sundaram are stoking fears. In reality, it's very scary to hear that as like a as a girl on this campus. Olivia Sanchez, managing editor at the Beacon, was at the Wally Awards during the speech. She said it detailed his sexual pursuits, stating that his main goal throughout college was not academic or athletic, but to get white women to sleep with brown men. Making a mockery of the college and of education in general. Many walked out, including head basketball coach Terry Porter. Spencer Saito says his friend, a soccer player, was there. And she said that she was, she was very stunned by it. A lot of people were walking out of the room, and she just didn't know what to do. I stopped by Sundaram's listed address for comment. You could see the blinds open and close as someone checked to see who was outside. Hello, it's Jennifer from Coin Six. Nobody answered. He had issued a short statement earlier in the day saying, I want to apologize for taking away from the focus of the night. The night is meant to celebrate the excellence of student athletes, and I would like to apologize if I made any people uncomfortable. The university also stating, these offensive statements do not reflect the university or our mission. Students say it's not enough. I really think that if you're giving an MC speech, they should have gone over it. I definitely think that it's good that he was kicked out of the team um, to show discipline. And um, also, I don't think that maybe he shouldn't deserve a degree. And Sarah says she'd also like to see the university address women's safety and security on campus outside of this event. Back to you. All right, Jennifer Dowling on campus tonight. Mm -hmm. Thank you.